the warmer weather may feel nice, but when it comes to driving, it means dealing with the occasional pothole. I'm Jill Lampkins, your Northwest Omaha reporter on 108th and Fort Street, where tires are taking a beating and drivers are looking for a solution. It's this one. Oh it's like flat. Kylie Brown was driving on 90th and Maple Tuesday evening when she hit a large pothole. And then all of a sudden I hear like a big boom, like my tire like it goes like in and out like a big like speed bump, but it was like in. And then I was like my tire pressure turned on. I was like my poor tire. <laughs> Luckily for her, all she needed was air in her tires. But Jensen Tire and Auto Store Manager Eric Welton tells me other drivers have run into bigger pothole issues. Sometimes it's much more extensive than that. Sometimes you get steering components, suspension components, wheels that need to be replaced. This week, the store has seen an influx of drivers coming in with damaged vehicles. Well, I had to have a technician go out in the parking lot and fix one because we couldn't drive it into the shop. It was that bad. Acknowledging that roads are the issue, city leaders are looking at new ways to make Omaha streets stronger. This updated public works plan introduced Tuesday would set new cement and additive standards for our streets and it's something Eric supports. So if there's a way to update that, that's a more permanent fix instead of kind of a patch, if you will, that's great. Public work officials tell me the last standard specification plan was from 2014. It did not require additives for concrete to help it stand up to the harsh freezing and thawing pattern of winter. Once the new standards are set, all city contractors will have to follow them for road projects, including pothole fixtures. So people like Kylie can drive safely without worry of damaging her car. Um, I think it needs to happen. <laughs> I really do. I think it needs to happen. On February 13th, there will be a public hearing and vote on the updated standards. At 108th and Fort Street, I'm Jill Lampkins, your Northwest Omaha reporter.